As you saw, that was a masjid here in downtown Amman. And to be honest, every time I come here, I'm very disappointed. We see that these masjids are very empty. The Adan was going off. Allah is calling, Hayya ala al-Falah, rush to success, rush to prayer. But you will see in this extremely busy area of Amman, there'll be many, many men just sat there, you know, smoking and sitting, knowing that there's a prayer going on and they're sat there. And then we expect Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to help us, to help Palestine. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in the Quran, in Tansurullah Yansurku, if you obey the commandments of Allah, you put the effort in, Allah will help you. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala he says, Rijalun la tutin, la tuhin tijaratun wala bay'un an dikri la. A true man is the one who neither trade nor business distracts them from worshiping Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. When the Adan is called, all shops should be closed immediately. And then every single man should walk to the masjid and pray to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Allah doesn't need you, He doesn't need me. In takfuru fa inna Allah ghaniyun anku. If you all do kufr, Allah says, then Allah doesn't need you. He still has the kingdomship of the heavens and the earth. We are the ones who need the prayer. We are the ones who need Allah's help. So please, this is a message to every single man. If the Adan has been called and you are in the area when there's a masjid, you should go. And if you do not go, what are you going to say to Allah on the day of judgment? And how can you expect Allah to help us as an ummah that is being bloodied and bruised and broken when you're not even going to go and pray when Allah calls you to pray? Come on.